Hello church, my name is Lolita and I would like to encourage you with one of my financial miracles the Lord has done in my life. Um, right at the beginning of 2019, the Lord uh, gave me key scriptures to declare over my life. And one of the scripture was um, Isaiah 54 verse 5 where the Lord says, He is my husband. And another one was on Genesis 8 where it basically tells us that um, Adam and Eve walked in the cool of the day with the Lord. Um, basically what the Holy Spirit impressed on me uh, from the scriptures was to depend on him entirely. Um, just as Adam and Eve depended on him, um, they had no needs and they lacked no good, nothing at all because the Lord provided for them. So this is where the Lord was leading me to do. I de started declaring those scriptures over myself. And whenever I will face um, um, a financial difficulty and I will just declaring and, and really standing on those words and lifting up his holy name. But I remember one particular moment that I'm going to share with you. Uh, one morning I returned back from shopping and, and I just started uploading my shopping in the fridge. And um and I just noticed that there was no light in my fridge. And I thought, okay, that's nothing too serious. It's probably just the light bulb and that can be changed. So as I just began looking for different places where I could uh, buy a new light bulb, I just felt within my spirit, the Holy Spirit was telling me that the fridge freezer, the fridge freezer had stopped working. And just right then, um, I just felt as if there was an invasion of like negative thoughts just coming right through my mind. And I began to ask these questions to the Lord and like panicking and worrying and just like, Lord, how am I going to afford another fridge freezer? I don't have enough saving in my account for that. And I, as I just negative thoughts just, just kept coming one after another. Um, the next thing, I just felt a strengthening of the Holy Spirit and immediately the negative thoughts just stopped and all what I felt was just um, uh, uh, the Holy Spirit just invading me in such an amazing way and it was so refreshing and it led me to actually to begin to, to give thanks to God. So and I was like, okay, why not? Let's just start giving thanks to God. So I just started walking around the house and giving thanks to God and lifting up his name and just say, thank you, God, for a new fridge freezer. Thank you. And lifting up his holy name. Within 10 minutes, my phone rang and, and I picked up the phone. And do you know what? Usually there's no, nothing can stop me while I'm praising my God, even my son. And I'll be just like, hey, you've got to come back. Right now, I'm spending time with the Lord here. It's not time with us. But right then, I just felt like I needed to pick up my phone. So as soon as I pick up my phone, it's a friend of mine on the other line. And these are the words she says to me. She says, Lolita, um, do you still hold the same bank account as before? And I'm like, yeah, but why? She says, um, no, I, I was just just sat here I'm sorting out my finance um my, my bills and everything and I just felt uh, the Holy Spirit pressing on me to put some money into your account and I've already done I've already done that if you could just double check and send me a message um that you you know you've received the money and, and I was like is this real and so I, I thought no I've got to tell her what just took place right here so I started explaining to her all that had happened with the fridge and everything and she just these are the words that came out of her mouth she says, she says do you know God is our husband the moment she said that boom there was a light bulb within me okay no more in the fridge but that was within me and I thought there we go that's the word that he gave me these are that's one of the words I've been declaring over myself the Lord is my husband so therefore he provides for me so we hung up the phone we said goodbye to each other and I went into my account checking my account there's like a huge amount of money okay and I felt impressed by the holy spirit now buy yourself a new fridge freezer and i just began to dance and just give glory to god at right that moment i wanted to kiss god okay and i just like lord i want to kiss you right now so it was absolutely amazing and 
just imagine. So I wanted to really to encourage the church with this, that God is a um, provider. He's our Jehovah Jireh. His words, his, his, what he says he will do, he does. And I just want you to really to hold on to his word because it says that all the promises of God are yes and an amen in Christ Jesus. What God says he will do to you, he will do it because his faithfulness endures forever. He will give you the faith to believe for the impossible because he says with men it's impossible, but with God all things are possible. So just take hold of his words. Feed yourself with his words because He's about to do what you cannot even think or imagine according to the power that's at work within you. God is good. God is faithful. So I just wanted to encourage you with this uh, church. Have a great day. Ciao.